Yes, it seems to us that uh, bradykinin is the common factor between the ACE inhibitor cough and the COVID cough. Now, bradykinin is a polypeptide that was discovered long ago as a key part of the inflammation pathways. And uh, normally, uh, ACE uh, gets rid of it. And so when ACE is inhibited, you get an accumulation of bradykinin, and that's the cause of the ACE inhibitor cough. Yes, um, uh, ACE2 and ACE are generally um, in uh, counter relation to each other. That is, they counter each other on most of their activities and uh, the, the whole inflammation system is built on a series of checks and balances of counter-regulatory components. Uh, but in, when it comes to bradykinin, uh, these two enzymes both operate in the same way to reduce the levels of bradykinin. Not directly, uh, but that's the effect of their actions is to reduce the levels of bradykinin. So when you have uh, an ACE2 uh, system that is destroyed by invasion with coronavirus, uh, you have a release of its down regulation of bradykinin and you have a, a general increase in bradykinin levels. So that's the same thing as occurs with ACE inhibitors. <laughs>